Hello guys, how's it going? It's Harry Chewbacca. <clears throat> it's been a while. Uh, so, my friends got me playing this Cube World game. Uh, I've been playing it for a while, or not that long actually, but I'm still kind of a noob. But uh, it's pretty good. It's not. I, I like it. It took me a while to get into it. But uh, basically, I guess I'll show you guys it's like the basic stuff. So you got your your main abilities at the bottom there, M1, M2. M2 is the special ability. Uh, usually you hold it. Uh, let's see if we can find a practice target. Here's one over here. And then if you press X, you can actually access your skill points. And Guardian is like a tank. Berserker is like DPS. Uh, and you have talent points. Uh, so I'll use one of my talent points and I missed but I can just hold down right trigger on my mouse and it'll automatically attack while my special power builds up my MP power whatever and then I hold down M2 and I get a 39 critical hit 64 critical hit Anyways, and that's my bunny. Uh, I'll tell you how to get him uh, later, if I remember. Anyways, we'll just go now. Come on, bunny, let's go. I don't know how to get him to follow me. Because he'll just keep attacking. Uh, this is town. If you press M, you can move your, your map like this if you hold down uh, scroll, the scroll wheel. Press that down on your mouse and you can do this. Uh, zoom out, zoom in using your scroll. Change the like the level of the look of the map by just holding down right trigger and doing this. You can just experiment. If you go in close enough you can see the districts of, uh, of, the, of the city. We'll zoom out here. Um, if you press C, that's your, your crafting area. You can craft stuff in this one. Uh, if you press I, this is your inventory. It's like your bags. So, pet food. You use these to get pets. Uh, get out of here. Freaking annoying noise. Okay, so yeah, I, you can use these. Put it in your, uh, Oh, there it is. There we go. That's how you do it. So now my pet's gone. Now my pet's here. And he's still attacking. Anyways, you can use... That's the food. Here's another tab, ingredients, for making uh, food so you can eat. Um, these items, I got my potions I made. Formulas food for eating, equipment like armor, weapons, press I, press tab on your keyboard, you can scroll with A and D, and choose your potions or food, tab again, um, E is to pick up items, so you just press E, R is to like, it's like an action button, uh, that's, that's what I know so far. Um, yeah, that's about it for that. Uh, oh yeah, control is to climb. Uses up stamina. You get better at it the more you use your pinky. I use my pinky to just bend it down and reach. So, in other videos I'll show you how to make potions and maybe get a pet. Just because that it's just like really different than what we're focusing on right now. And these guys look like they're going to attack the city. If they're evil. Nope. Hard to tell sometimes. We'll go on a little adventure now. Leave the town. Ah, heart flower. That's important for making the potion. So that's good for the next video. Now here we got some enemies that are probably going to own me. Up ahead there. 
if you hold down O, it's a little trick. I'm pretty sure it's just a glitch, and it'll be patched. But if you hold down O, you get your MP power, and it's just, yeah, it just makes it so you can use your special ability more. So I'll use my. There we go. Oh, instant kill. Easy. Use E to pick that money up. Got four XP out of that. Here's crops. You harvest fruits and vegetables and then cook them over fires. That's how you make your your Shazam. Uh, I believe I have a vial. No, I'll focus that later on. Basically in this game all I do is level up and kill. It's pretty fun just doing that. Using the glitch. Ooh, he's getting some good hits off. Ooh. There we go. Let's stop him. I'll eat some food. Pressing Q is to eat food. Sometimes I accidentally press instead of one, and it's really annoying in a fight. To stop eating, you just press your attack button right. Right trigger. No, left trigger, sorry. Attacks. You can also have, like, you can basically have any animal you see, or insect, or whatever creature you see in this game as a pet with the right food. So um, I'll kill these flies. Missed. That was easy. Now these things up ahead is the graveyards. There's a ton of them. You can just spawn. You just spawn on them. I have cats as pets. I'll go see if this thing's friendly or not. Nope. That was nice. So, uh, if you want to ride your mount, what I have to do is see a trainer. It tells me right there. I right click, and then here's my skill points. Now I have zero there, but I can't use it on anything, because I need to see my trainer, I can't learn it. But uh, I want to get the riding ability so I can fast travel, faster travel. But for right now I'm stuck on smash, so I just use my smash ability, which is good. I'm happy with it. These are destructible. Uh, the land's destructible with bombs and stuff. I think it's all destructible. What I do with this, I'm just gonna hold down O, measure it up, and oh, there we go. Special ability. Miss. <laughs> okay. Try this again. No! Don't have the O. Don't have the special ability. My one button. Or I should say my power spell, whatever. I'm terrible, but whatever. Hey, level five. Uh, later on, I'll show you guys gameplay of me and my friends. We'll be screwing around. Ooh, chickens. See how hard they are to kill. They don't give off much XP, it's not worth it. You got your compass in the right hand corner too. Um, 
Yeah, the map's pretty big, if you zoom out all the way. I'm not sure if it's infinity, but it's pretty big. These are like castles, or I don't know. The These right here, they're like castles. Yeah, here's one right over there. It's even marked. So these are castles. Usually they have like bosses, world bo uh, not world bosses, but just like bosses with lots of health. Best to have a party or you have to be really high level or something. Uh, if you press scroll, if you press your scroll down on your mouse, you can actually roll. And that's good for uh, dodging enemy attacks. But watch out for your stamina. Um, now, under the pet bar, I have no idea what that is. I'll come back to that later on in another video. To get ingredients, this is what wood looks like. So, for making some stuff like armor and weapons, you need wood, wood blocks and stuff. Uh, right here. And if you can't make it, you just look down here and it says requires furnace, requires saw, requires furnace, requires campfire. Uh, yeah, but this is what wood looks like. Just destroy it. Press E to pick it up. Easy. Easy like that. That's basically like the introduction to this game. I mean, can't really think of anything else. It's pretty simple. We'll go through these one more time. Weapons. It was complicated at first for me. Like, just... I don't know. Well, it wasn't complicated, just a little confusing. But most most games are when you get first time you play armor. Uh, now this isn't the armor I have. Remember, these are just stuff you can make if you have the right ingredients. Iron cube. These are the ingredients you need. So don't don't get confused with C and I, the buttons on your keyboard. This is all stuff you can make. It's not nothing you have. I is what you have, so right now this is what I have. Oh, look at that. I can wear my chest, my chest armor I want to wear. It's power 17, so it's like item level 17, so I can wear that. And it's going to be an upgrade to mine. So, currently equipped. It's way better than my scratched iron chest armor. So I'll be selling that. And then, what's this? I just learned that by right clicking it. So now that's learnt and I can apply that. These are the pet food to get pets. Ingredients to make stuff. Simple like that. Easy, easy talent tree. That's that. Uh, thanks for watching. There's going to be a lot more coming in this game. Uh, just because it's new and uh, I've been playing it a lot recently. So we'll see where it takes us. Uh, peace, guys.